Hey there guys, Sly Fox Kenyo here with the next episode of Final Fantasy XII. So, in the last episode, we had just fallen from the prison into this dark, nasty underbelly. Hello, pick up the treasure, you motherfucker. Oh. Press the switch. Nothing happens. Power to the gate has been cut. Awesome. Well, I guess we need to restore power then. Can you help us restore power? Of course that was the only way out. Long sword, nobody can use it. Silver bow, Fran can use that. Cannot be equipped at a shop, why? That's a... Okay. Mage Master, finally. Anything else? Nope. Okay. Leather breastplate. That's what it looks like. Alright. Looks like that's the best. Ooh, hello. Immune to blind. Half damage from dark. Uh, yeah, we'll get one of those. That's handy. We'll give it to Fr we'll give it to Fran, because she has to be able to see. Onion arrows, onion bolts, onion shots, that's all we've already got. Oh, we'll buy Libra. Hey, some spells. Ooh, gambits. Gambits are always handy. Buy as many gambits as you can, as quickly as you can. They make your life so much easier in the long run. And it's totally worth it to just blow all your gill on gambits in the beginning. Um, there's very few places that only sell specific spells, but there's a lot of places that only sell specific gambits. So, this is going to be a good way for me to help customize my gambit trees by a wide margin. Um, and once you get a lot of these gambits, ooh, here we go. Um, you never have to worry about getting them again. Now, the less than percentages ones aren't necessarily that useful. You could chicken pick and only get the ones that you wanted um, without having too much of an issue. We want slow. We want blind up. We want dark. We want to mobilize. We want thunder. And we want fox. And poison off. Okay. That was a lot of buying and spelling, um, selling. Hold on. I knew it went safe, but well, here I am. Alright, so you're stuck down here. We just bought a shit ton of stuff. I need to sell a shit ton of stuff. That's not teleport stones. There we go. Okay. Must be lever to operate it. The lever doesn't work. Can I not? <sighs> you piece of shit, is there nothing that I can do? Yeah. Yeah, suck. Yeah, 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 whatever. whatever. I don't I don't care. There's a puzzle to be puzzled here and I need to puzzle it. Optimize, optimize, there we go. Alright. So, if that's the only way out, pardon me, I'm gonna save really fast. If this up, up the up the up way the uh, the way that goes up if the stairs are the only way out and that's where we came from what more can I do hmm. do I have ally statuses blind I don't have any ally statuses yet 
Okay. So for now, those extra gambits that I bought aren't going to come in useful because I'm still missing a couple of the gambits that I need. Um. God damn. There's got to be something here. They they don't lock you in. Ah, here's a switch. Press the switch. The fuse is blown. Hmm. So can I buy a fuse from you? Good, sir. Is that something that can be done? Do you have a spare fuse by chance? To Oh, you, you just give us one. That's nice. It's as good as any you'll find and better than most. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Install the tube fuse. And there's a little bit of charge? No charge? Maybe? Hey, there's a charge. Huzzah. And I'm sure that means that there's probably a time limit on this, too. For as much as I played this game, I've forgotten the vast majority of it. And like I said, I, it wasn't like I played this game all the time. I have played this game in the past. There you go. Thirty percent to operate the gates. Hmm. Alright, well, see you later then, man. I'm gonna go kill some things and some stuff. Hey, it's Power Sucker. Hey, who turned out the lights? Hmm? One of those? I've heard of these. Mimics. They disguise themselves as all manner of things, then strike when you're least wary. Kind of some mimics. of them have a fondness for energy, I'm told. They gorge themselves on the stuff till there's naught left. So, um, what happens then? Hmm. Then, zombies. Lights out, and it's worse in the dark. Much, Much worse. worse. <laughs> so, let them get too close to one of those conduits, and they'll suck it dry. But don't worry, it'll give the energy back if you ask nicely. Sticking it with a sword helps too. Clock's ticking. So kill all the mimics. Or the zombie first, I guess. Kill the zombie. Damn! Fran was not screwing around. Oh no, you discharged all over me. How inconvenient for you. Yeah. <laughs> I should have bought more potions while I was there. I didn't think about that. Oops. Oh well. He saw it. Kill all of the things. Yeah, go ahead. Feed on whatever you want. That's fine. I don't care. Yeah. You, you don't scare me. I will destroy you. All of you. Pile of iron scraps. Oh, treasure chest, oh, it's a barrel. Oh, there was actually a treasure chest sitting in the corner. I was about to laugh. I was gonna be like, really? Who has a treasure chest just sitting in a mine? There you go. You dead. You dead, boy. Hmm. Those treasures look awful lot like mimics, don't you think? I'm sure that's pure coincidence. And nothing to be concerned about. Ha. You, battery mimic, die! Yeah. God, I'm so used to having haste on these characters that this all feels so slow. Once you get haste, you want to have auto haste on at all times. You want to have somebody casting haste on all allies that don't have it. Because it makes your life so much easier in this game. Like, leaps and bounds easier. And there are some enemies you just simply can't do enough damage to to kill without it, so. It's a good thing to keep in mind. There are two pathways here. One of them leads to where we're supposed to go, one of them does not. Let's go down the way that does not. 
Although I have a feeling that that battery mimic is going to give me a hard time, but that's okay. Oh, no, we have to go that way first, okay. Well then, let's go that way first. Is there a treasure chest over here? There is. I knew it. You don't ever just have a blind corner. 44 gil. Cool. Just walking down the street, found 44 bucks. I'll take it. Yeah. Whack. Quit discharging over me. I don't like your discharge. You can feed from all you want. Yay, Fran leveled up finally. I guess both of you did too, yeah. How many? We got 29 license points. That's not very many. We need more than that. We need to be able to actually go and do and spend freely. So we just gotta kill more stuff. Um, once you get the golden amulet, that actually helps um, as well because that doubles all LP earned. So it's really handy to get that and then run around the starting area and just one-shotting things. You can get a lot of LP really fast. Oops, not what I wanted, I wanted that one. There we go. I just get so used to seeing the map on screen that when it's not on screen, I'm like, huh? Yeah, let's go this way first. Damn it, that's the right way. <sighs> let's go the wrong way first. I went to go the wrong way. Where are you going? Yeah. Dude's running away. He's like, no, no. Okay, you're just gonna... You're just gonna go over there and feed. I'm fine with that. They say it gets much worse in the dark, they exaggerate greatly. It's really not that bad. The zomb there are a lot of zombies, but they aren't too quick to overwhelm you. Um, just enough to be entertaining. Yes, I see the treasure, but let me kill the mimic first. The battery mimic. Yeah, we have all of our charge back. Hmm. Dude, Paul Thier just like knocked that guy. <laughs> Instead of Bosch, Bosch came through and was like, oh, we're shooting this guy? How about I just give him an uppercut to his jaw? Yeah, I got a map. Maps are handy. Sneaks past us. Like, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna get this. Like, dude, we are yeah. literally going to kill you. Yeah. Oh, there's two of them in this room. Oh, my dog's going crazy outside, apparently. Ha! <laughs> 
Kill all the things. Kill them all. Kill them dead. Kill them! Everything. Yeah. Yay! Thank you, exclamation mark, for showing me something I would have otherwise missed. It's greatly appreciated. God, can we get out of this passage already? There's so much to do, so many things to kill. Why is there a rod just like laying on the the ground? That can't be like safe. <laughs> People would die for that, like or over that. That's that's not a good thing. You're just walking along, you step on a rod, and, just, and that's it. You're just dead. Oh, hi, Flynn. Steal from you, cool. I don't know, I can steal. Mm. Yeah, yeah, I stole some green liquor. <laughs> so, this is B and C. Where's A? Not like that. He died quickly. Where is Flan A? I'm looking for Flan A. Anybody seen Flan A? Calling Flan A. That's Flan D. When are these guys gonna learn? They can't handle us. Ooh. Are you Flan A? You're Flan E. Where the hell is Flan A? Did I kill Flan A and not even realize it? I might have. I don't know. Uh, ooh, there's a treasure down there. Make sure we get the treasure. If you're wondering why I'm stealing so much, it's because there's a trophy for getting 50 successful steals, so I'm I'm trying to constantly, just continually um, steal from things that will help me in my quest. Yay, Van leveled up. He's less of a bitch now. I obtained a head guard. <laughs> you literally found a helmet lying on the side of a dirty old waterway or alley and you decide it'd be a good idea to put this on my head. Game logic kiddos. Video game logic. There we go. That was wasn't much to that plan. No, was there? 
he just kind of got hit a few times and fell over. Pointy hat. I got the pointy hat. Does anybody need a pointy hat? Oh, but still take a head guard. Oh, let's give it to Fran. She has less HP. Excuse me. Yeah. The village of the pointy hats. Final Fantasy IX reference for those of you yeah. that watch it. If you haven't watched it, play through it on my channel. Whole thing, whole game, top to bottom. Optional bosses included. Well, most of the optional bosses. I think I might miss one or two, but eh. I even show you Azuma, and that's a fun one. Never kill him! Didn't want to put that much time into it, because god damn. But there is an Azuma fight in there. So if you're curious as to what an Azuma even is, then go and check out my Final Fantasy IX uh, playthrough. My dog is going ape out there. Seeds. It reeks. Something's close. <clears throat> nice moves there, Captain. You mean traitor? So they say. But I didn't see him kill anyone. My brother did. <sighs> Rex. He said he had a brother two years younger. I see. He meant you. Your brother. What became of- He's dead. I'm sorry. It was you who killed him! 
I give you my word. That was not the way of it. Rex, sir. My name's Rex. Rex. All I have left, sir. He's two years younger than I. It's time, Bosch. Save the discussion for later. We found them! But if we arrive after he signed the treaty... Sir, we have no, little sir. time. You must I go to the tank. They're slowing us down. Captain and for please. my parents. Captain, why? Our king, what have you done? His majesty was a traitor. A twin brother. Fancy that. Hmm. But still, the pieces fit, I'll give you that much. And he did look like you. I don't believe you. Of course not. It was my fault that Rex was there. I am sorry. My brother, he trusted you. He trusted you and he lost everything. How can I believe you? Not me, then. Believe in your brother. He was a fine soldier. He fought to the last to protect his homeland. Now, surely he fought to protect his brother. You don't know anything! Believe what you want to, whatever it takes to make you happy. What's done is done. Balthier is such a smooth talking mother fucker. I love it. I love how smooth Balthier is. It's freaking awesome. Also, yeah, if you didn't catch all of that, so what had happened is that Bosch has a twin brother who was part of the Imperial Army, who when they took over actually betray look made it look like Bosch was the betrayer when really it was his brother who was working for the Imperial Army all along. Gotta love those twin brothers, they're complete assholes. Alright, where are we going? We're going this way. Cause there's a guy eating stuff over here. Let's kill him! Alright. There is a boss fight coming up, but until we get to that boss fight there isn't much else to see except for more of the same, so I will That is so pretty, like, could you imagine, like, one of those underground caves that's actually this big and just full of water? I would love to see something like that in real life. That's just me, though. Maybe. Yeah! 
How convenient, no enemies in a save point. Not like there's a boss battle coming up or anything. I, I love how they just project it like, hmm, the next is a big open the next area is a big open area. This area is a small room with a save point in it. Wonder if anything could happen. Alright guys, you ready for this? Let's get loose. Let's get funky. It's gonna be a boss battle. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. Let's get loose. Just, just. Yeah. Alright. Let's do it. Somebody say big fucking mimic? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I silenced the mimic queen. That's hilarious. I didn't know you could. You just learned some I just learned something from the um I need to turn off my camera hold on. You go off. I don't want you stealing me now, I want you killing. Um, <laughs> I didn't know you could actually silence um, this boss. I know bosses are susceptible to status effects, I just didn't realize this particular one was. Hey, tiny battery, can you die for a second? And by first second, I mean, can you just die? Thank you. Hey, other tiny battery, can you just die for a second? <laughs> It's really not too, too big of an issue to deal with these things, um, but it is helpful to deal with them early on because they will eventually start causing problems for you. Hey, Balthier, let's do some fires of war, shall we? I never miss. Oh, really? I'm not gonna get it? Fine, whatever. But hey, it's a 4400 damage. I tried. I tried, guys. I tried really hard to get it. I shuffled it like six times. Yeah, you can breath of life all you want. You're still gonna die. Spawn. Spawn. Like, <laughs> oh. Don't give birth in front of me, lady. It's weird. Weird. Oh. We're about to do serious damage. <laughs> Oops. Totally forgot about that. It's okay. We've got a healer on the team. Bye, the big queen. So that's the thing about bosses. They actually have cutscene abilities that are going to fuck you up sometimes. And some of them, you just die. And it's really unfortunate. Um, but in this case, it's not the case.
To think Dalmascan air could taste so sweet. Where are we? The Esther Sand, by the look of it. Let's back to Rabanasta before we shrivel up. By your leave, Captain. Yes, the hour of my return is already over late. The people may hate me, but that does not free me of my charge. All right, and back in the Esther Sand we are, and much more shall continue on after this. But I'm gonna do a little bit of grinding and stuff as we make our way back to Rabin Astro, because that's where the story starts again. So we will pick up the next episode there, and I will see you guys in it. So thank you all very much for watching. I hope you're enjoying this playthrough of Final Fantasy XII. And remember, through gaming, we can change the world. Sly Fox out.